around our program for the last you know month or so and um, the last two weeks our guys have been showing incredible character and toughness and they have hung together and embodied everything that we've been talking about um, I, I had a hunch that we were going to play good because our guys practiced unbelievably well this week. They were really tuned in. They were flying around. They were excited to play. Uh, I made the decision that uh, we weren't going to downplay the rivalry, that we were going to play it up and make sure everybody understood how important this game was, not only to, uh, to our players and our staff, to our department, to our university, but also to the northern Nevada community. I know that this season's been a little bit frustrating. Nobody's more frustrated than we've been. Um, but there's there's a cadre of really, really loyal Pack fans. And I'm not talking about the ones that jumped off the bandwagon when things got a little bit tough. I'm talking about the really, really loyal cadre of Pack fans, and we're bringing the cannon home for them. And um, and, and I'm excited to paint it blue and, and watch our guys enjoy this because they've deserved it. Um, as far as the game goes, James Butler played unbelievably well. The offensive line played unbelievably well. I thought that um, I, I thought that uh, Ty Ganji was not only efficient in the passing game, but he was smart. We had some passes called that they didn't have enough people in the box that Ty checked us out of it, put us in a run. What he did at the line of scrimmage was fantastic. And then obviously nearly 100 yards in the zone read game with his feet, which I thought was a great equalizer. Um, the last drive is an unbelievable drive to get the ball with eight minutes to go. And we, we know we're going to run it. They know we're going to run it. And yet we go down the field. I thought 20 was unbelievable. Um, special teams wise, we felt like, I felt like.